Brian, thank you. Businesses across the valley are still cleaning up storm debris from the weekend. Our Jeremiah Marshall was in Hidalgo County and has a look what business owners are going through. And then all of a sudden it just rushed in. It rushed in crazy. Managing partner of the Gremlin in McAllen, Antonio Reyna, says the strong winds from the weekend severe weather was frightening. The storm caused their 100-year-old pecan tree to fall, hitting their chimney and causing damage to their roof. The power was flickering, um, and then I saw water coming in through the roof, and I saw, a, 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 I thought, a, First it was lightning, and then it was, I thought a branch fell uh, from this 100-year-old pecan tree. Reyna couldn't believe the aftermath. A huge mess, a huge, 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 huge mess, and so it's just been cleaned up ever since. And they weren't alone. So we did have some kennel damages um, to our dog kennels. Uh, we also had uh, broken and shattered windows as well. Staff with the Palm Valley Animal Society say repairs are reaching almost $30,000. The storm damage affected their property to even spaces for their four-legged friends who are in need of forever homes. So not having those play yards negatively affects our pets. You know, they're not able to get out. They're not able to run around and de-stress. You know, imagine just being stuck in one room the entire day for a couple of weeks. It's going to stress our pets out. The nonprofit is now asking help from the community. So, as our largest intake center in the region, having every kennel habitable is just so huge and very important. There's hundreds of animals coming in in a week, so the sooner we get those funds, um, the sooner we get everything repaired, the sooner we can get back to operating. Yet business owners say the weekend storm weather could have been much worse. No one was hurt. Thank God no one was hurt. That was the most important thing. And then safety of, of, of uh, the customers, the patrons. So it was sort of just like, you know, we just weathered it out. Working for you in Hidalgo County, I'm Jeremiah Marshall.